What is up, gang lang Your presidential trio is back at it again, but this time we are giving Wordle a try, since we figured that if we all combined our brain power, we'd make the perfect being. What a load of bull. Joey just kept begging us to play because he couldn't figure this out on his own. I already consider myself to be a perfect being. My DNA is made up of USA, and I know I can easily do this Wordle just like how I can eat a Big Mac in under 15 seconds. No shot you freaking eat a Big Mac in under 15 seconds. Whoa, 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 settle down there, Barack. I should have figured you took competitive eating seriously with the amount of dick eating you do. The only dick Barry eats is the spotted one. Joe, that really doesn't help at all. No, it does, because spotted dick is a traditional British steamed pudding. So like you kind of owned him because you eat pudding. Oh yeah, he totally owned me with that one, Sleepy Joe. God, whatever. Can we start this game of Wordle already? I want the first dib at the word. Barack, I doubt the word bombs will be the word of the day. Why don't you put something else instead? I wasn't gonna put bombs, you idiot. How about we do something like clank? Ooh, like Ratchet and Clank. I was just playing the PS5 game. I like that idea. Okay, so you guys said clink, like that one Pokemon from Black and White. Jesus Christ. Joe, you idiot. Yeah, sorry guys, but that word isn't a real thing. How about we do something along the lines of, like, poopy? What a freaking idiot. Jesus Christ. He actually went ahead and put poopy and didn't get a single goddamn helpful hint from it. Jesus Joe, is that really all you could come up with? Yeah, actually, that was all that came to mind. It's okay. Me being the genius that I am, I will select the next word for us, and I am feeling the word tunas. I just had a delicious tuna sandwich, so I'm feeling good about it. Okay, let's go ahead and do tunas, and would you look at that? We have an N and an A in our word. Once again, I'm saving us from Sleepy Joe's mistakes. All right, well, that's cool and all for you, but can I finally have my turn? Wait, I think I got this solved already. This has to be named. Like, trust me on this, guys. Well, you used up my turn and didn't even get it correct, Joe. How do you feel? I'm not gonna lie, I still feel accomplished and I won't apologize for it. We can go ahead and do your stupid clank word and probably waste our turn. Joe, for the love of God, can you type any faster? Sorry, my mouse is sticky. Wait, what? Yeah, about that. You don't wanna know, trust me. I don't think I'll ask then. And would you look at that? I had three freaking correct placements, and had we put that from the start, we would have solved this in probably two or three turns instead of what we have now. Yeah, Joe, you screwed us over yet again, but you have given me the ultimate opportunity to win this game, and I will be using the word glank. I've never heard of the word glank before. Uh, yeah, about that word Donald, it doesn't exist. I meant blank, you idiot. Of course I know a glank isn't a real word. You'd have to be an idiot to believe that. Well, either way, it was wrong, and we are on our last freaking try. Way to go, everyone. You cannot fucking blame me for anything that has transpired. I would have had us right there if you just would have listened to me, Joey. Now we have to really sit back and ponder about this next word. It is our last try at winning, and we have to start off this series with a good streak. Now let's all put our heads together and think about it. If it wasn't clank or blank, then what other words could it be? As long as Joey stays quiet, we should get this, Barack. It can't be plank because we know poopy didn't work. It can't be slank either because there's no letter S. Oh, snap, crackle, pop, this is easy. It's flank. Like when you order flank steak or when you flank an enemy. I am such a freaking genius. No mind can compete with my intellectualism. I'm actually so pissed off that he got it right. Joey, I hope you know that you only got it right because me and Donald literally carried you the whole way through. I got clank going and then Donald did blank and we basically spoon fed you this answer. Yeah, don't go thinking you're a genius now, Joey, because we quite literally solved it for you. I guess you'll go ahead and take credit for my accomplishments once again, since that's what you love doing as a president. Wow, guys, I'm sorry, I didn't know. Yeah, of course you didn't know because we help you constantly. Color me surprised he didn't know. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't know you two were such little bitches.